Have you ever wondered what the future holds for human evolution? Let's embark on a journey that transcends the ordinary and delves into the extraordinary. We're not talking about a few hundred years into the future, we are talking about thousands. But first, please subscribe to our channel. Since we are still quite small, that would help us a lot. Our journey begins with the concept of transitioning to a type 1 or type 2 civilization. This is not a mere upgrade from our current status quo. We're talking about harnessing the energy of our entire planet, and then, the entire star that gives us light and life. Imagine a world where our technological advancements are so integrated into our bodies, they become extensions of our very being. Consider the work of visionaries like Elon Musk with Neuralink, working towards enhancing our brain functions and connectivity. This is not science fiction. This is the dawn of a new era in human evolution. Then there's genetic engineering, a domain that offers the tantalizing prospect of tailoring human genetics for disease resistance, longevity, and enhanced physical and cognitive abilities. Imagine being able to edit out genetic diseases, increasing our lifespan, and even enhancing our abilities. It's like stepping into a whole new realm of existence. Of course, such powers and abilities come with profound questions and challenges. With great power, as they say, comes great responsibility. How do we ensure these technologies are used ethically and responsibly? How do we prevent them from becoming tools of oppression or instruments of inequality? And perhaps most importantly, how do we preserve the essence of what makes us human in the face of such profound changes? These are not easy questions, and there are no easy answers, but they are the questions we must grapple with as we stand at the dawn of this new era in human evolution. As we look to the horizon, we see a future filled with potential, brimming with possibilities, but also fraught with challenges and perils. As we stand on the precipice of this new era, we must ask ourselves, are we ready for what comes next? Our planet, our home, is at a crossroads. As we peer into the future, we see two distinct possibilities, a world that heals and flourishes, or a world that crumbles and fades. This is our ultimate test. In one scenario, we rise to the challenge, harnessing our collective intellect and creativity to heal our environment. We embrace sustainable living, replacing fossil fuels with renewable energy sources, reducing our carbon footprint, and restoring the balance of our ecosystems. In tandem, our cities evolve into bastions of efficiency and harmony. Think vertical farms feeding millions without straining our soil, green architecture that breathes with nature, and smart cities humming with clean, silent energy. Yet there is another, darker path, a path marked by catastrophic collapse from warfare, unchecked pollution, and natural disasters. The path we choose now will determine the health and survival of our planet. Our journey does not end on Earth. In fact, it's only just beginning. As we venture into the cosmos, we strive to establish a human presence beyond our home planet. Lunar colonies serve as our initial stepping stones, providing vital experience and resources for deeper space exploration. The moon, a celestial body so close yet so foreign, is set to become our second home. But we won't stop there. Mars, the red desert in the sky, holds the promise of a new frontier, overcoming the challenges of sustaining life on this alien world. From terraforming to self-sustaining habitats, will test the limits of human ingenuity and resilience. Yet, our sights are set even further. We're embarking on the ultimate quest, light speed travel. Breaking this barrier will not only allow us to explore distant galaxies, but may also lead to encounters with extraterrestrial civilizations. The stars are the next chapter in our evolutionary story. As we look to the stars, let's not forget the advancements happening right here on Earth. Artificial intelligence, or AI, is weaving itself into the fabric of our society, becoming as integral as electricity once was. From automating tedious tasks to enhancing our creative and cognitive functions, AI is reshaping our world. But as with any powerful tool, it presents us with a host of ethical quandaries. How do we ensure AI serves us without infringing on our rights or freedoms? What happens when an AI becomes conscious? These are the questions we must grapple with as we step into this brave new world. And yet beyond the challenges lies a tantalizing possibility, a symbiosis between humans and AI. Imagine a future where we coexist, our identities and civilization enriched, not threatened by AI. A new era is dawning, one of unprecedented possibilities and complex dilemmas. In the dance between humans and AI, who will lead and who will follow? What if we could live forever? It's a question that has echoed throughout the ages and now we may be on the brink of answering it. 
As we delve into the future of health and longevity, revolutionary medical treatments are taking center stage. From the marvels of nanotechnology to the potentials of personalized medicine, we are not just extending human lifespan, but enhancing the quality of life. Take a moment to consider the brain-body connection. Advances in technology are paving the way for improved understanding and treatment of mental health, creating a future where well-being is not just a goal, but a given. And then, we come to the end of aging. Researchers around the globe are tirelessly working towards slowing down and even reversing the aging process. Imagine a world where every wrinkle can be ironed out, not just on the surface, but deep within our biological fabric. The fountain of youth may no longer be a myth, but a milestone in human evolution. With great technological power comes great societal change. As we stand on the precipice of a new era, the future of work is being reshaped by artificial intelligence. The traditional job market is undergoing a seismic shift as automation and AI technologies become increasingly prevalent. This transformation is not just about replacing manual labor with machines, but about enhancing human capabilities fostering creativity, and opening up new avenues of employment that we can't even imagine today. In this AI-driven world, education and skills acquisition will also see a radical overhaul. The emphasis will be on lifelong learning and adaptability, as the pace of technological change outpaces traditional education models. We are likely to see a rise in online learning platforms, virtual reality classrooms, and personalized education strategies designed to equip individuals with the skills needed to navigate this brave new world. But what about the economy? The digital revolution has already given birth to cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, challenging traditional economic systems and offering a decentralized alternative. In the future, we could see digital currencies becoming mainstream, disrupting the way we conduct business and manage our finances. Yet, technology is not just about disruption, it's about transformation. As we move towards a more automated world, concepts like universal basic income become more relevant. By providing a financial safety net for all, we could potentially alleviate poverty, reduce inequality, and ensure a fair distribution of wealth in a world where traditional jobs may no longer be the norm. However, the future is not without its challenges. As technology becomes increasingly ingrained in our lives, it's crucial that we ensure equality and access for everyone, regardless of their geographic location or economic status. Strategies for bridging the digital divide will be key to creating a future where technology is a tool for empowerment, not exclusion. As our world evolves, so too must our societal structures. The future is not just about technology, but about our humanity. It's about building a society where everyone has the opportunity to thrive, where technology is used to enhance our lives, not dictate them. Because at the end of the day, it's not just about surviving in the future, it's about flourishing.